I found a mystery package in the mail. Time to figure out what's inside. What's up guys, we're back with another epic video. Today, we have the mystery package that was in the mail. I believe this was from GG Vision. So we're gonna open this up. But first, we have a giveaway. I'll be giving away this first edition Legacy of Darkness, probably light pack. All you have to do is like this video, be subscribed, and let me know your favorite card we open in this opening. And let's get into it. He sent me this because he wanted to show you guys his series, Card Games versus Humanity. So we're gonna have a clip pop up on the screen before we open this. For some reason, the King of Yamakaze actually appears when it is summoned before slipping into the darkness with no exploitation of its attack points. Oh wait, there's the Reaper of the Cards getting destroyed by the King's attack. Silly me. I guess I must have forgot the Spellbinding Circle has a built-in attack guidance armor property to it. What was I thinking? Then Panic says the same thing I said to my mom every time she tried to open my room door as a teenager. Stop! Stop it! I can't stand the light! Yugi skips Panic's turn and then activates the Swords of Revealing Light, a card so powerful that it apparently can make the side of his screen on his computer work now. If you guys enjoyed that, make sure you guys go check out his channel. Let's see what he sent us. We're gonna do this like a mystery package. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna slowly open these. He's put this in this Pop-Tart wrapping. I don't, I don't really know of anyone besides him that does this, so it's very unique to him. It's a little bit uh, sharp, a little bit dangerous, so I'm gonna try and not spoil what's in here. Let's see what's inside. It's gonna be like a mystery box. I don't know what's inside. Oh, okay, we ruined two of them. Uh, 2020... 2021 Den of Ancient Battles. I said 2020. I don't know what I just said. All right, let's see what's inside. Can we pull something good? We have a Proxy F Magician. We've got the uh, Ret Timer, the AIQ, Melfi Puppy, Torpedo Takedown, the Gasari, the Shiny Black Sea. That's a super rare. The XC's Import, the Wind, the Wind Channeler. Oh, and a Zeus in the first pack. All right, and a, a GG. Very nice. From GG Vision. Get it? There's a lot of GGs going on here. Okay, very nice. All right, that's a good start for the mystery. So far, we've gotten two 10 of Ancient Battles 10s, which is, okay, pretty new. Pretty new stuff. Hoping for some older stuff in here. Let's see if we can get it. All right. Melfi Finney. We got the Light Dragon. The Latu. The Ignister. I don't think I said that one right. Oliver. The Device. The Goki Guts. The Deep Street Minstrel. Arc Rebellion Xyz Dragon, the Warning Point, Tri Brigade Farragut, the Barren Blossom, True Light for Dark Ma no, Blue Eyes, I should say, and the Gizmet Kaku, the Supreme Shining Sky Stag. All right. Oh, Adam Emancipator Friends, best secret rare ever. Okay. Next we have, what is this? Okay. Uh, it seems like we got an entire tin of Ancient Battles. <laughs> yeah, see what we did there? All three of them. Uh, that might be... Okay, I don't know how many of those we're going to get, but we got three. That's one ten, so I figure this will be all three. The Ignister, we've got the Gigabyte, the Rainbowzo, the Strena, the Soldier Gaia, the Dark Lord Uprising, Thunderhand, Adam Emancipator Seeker, Raviel, Lord of Phantasms, Adam Emancipator Risen Dragite, and Gearsu the Orcs Mech Knight. That's a decent one. Okay, so we've got another decent Ultra Rare. No Noblemen are... No cross-out designator, not nobleman. Different card, even though they look the same. But uh, well, we're still looking. We're still, what's the other one? And uh, triple tactics talents we want to get as well. Let's see what the next one is. Crimson Crisis. So here we are. We've hit some old school stuff, which is pretty nice. Crimson Crisis. Can we get the Red Dragon Archfiend Assault Mode? That would be pretty cool. Ghost Rare. I'm down to pull it. I don't really remember anything else that's in this set. I don't know what they're... This feels European. These are very slick cards, if you know what I mean. Morphtronic Slingin. Okay. We got the Telekinetic Power Well. The Spell Reactor Re. Re! We got the Dupe Frog. We got the Desert Protector from Star Wars Clone War. Attack of the Clone, sorry. Vengeful Servant. We got the Morphtronic Borden. Debris Dragon. That's a pretty good pull. Very nice card. And... Flip Flop Frog. Also not a terrible card. Okay. Not bad. All right. Next pack we have Maximum Gold El Dorado. Okay. All right. Let's see what it is. What's going to be inside? Will we get the Gold Dark Magician, the Blue Eyes? Here we go. Number four. The Starlight Road. The Prank Kids Lampsies. The Phantom Knights of Breaksword. Oh, and a Pot of Extravagance. Okay. That's a good one. Okay, I don't remember what these go for, but these are definitely going to be one of the money cards out of the set. So, Pot of Extravagance, Zeus, and a Gear Suit. We're doing okay so far. Inside the next one, we have... 
Another maximum gold. Okay, maximum gold El Dorado. Let's see. Will we get another ghost or a gold? Another, not another ghost. Well, we will get another gold rare. What am I even asking? Of course, we're going to get a gold rare. Baby Sarasaurus. We got a Lagia for those dino decks. And we got a familiar possessed Lina. Very nice. Okay, and a Dragoonity Romulus. Okay, we're down to like only two packs left. Okay, let's see. So we got one of his Patreon power pack. The Tragic Jewelers? Okay, Tragic Jewelers. Got it. All right, these are not easy to open, though. All right, let's see what we can get inside. We got the Ambulance Rescue Roid, the Synthetic Seraphim, the Black Terra, the Cocoon Veil, Chrysalis Larva, Chrysalis Pantel. We got the Swift Birdman Joe, Searchlight Man, the Royal Knight, we got the Dark Lucius Level 4. Alert Queen level 3. The King Dragoon. That's a very nice super rare. Okay, that's good. Modolce Messengelato. Azura Priest is a pretty cool retro pack 2 card. Miracle Rupture. Okay, from Armageddon. A Numeron Network for those Numeron decks. Everyone hates those now that uh, Master Duel has really brought them to light. The Redox. Alright, there you go, Gage. And another Redox. Back-to-back -back Redox. That's kind of... Kind of weird, actually. Okay, in the final pack here, we're probably... No, no, two more packs. We're probably gonna have to open more packs, because this this was not a long enough video. I expected there to be more, more packs in this. Okay. I might pull out a couple other things, because this is a very short video. We've got a Super Dreadnought Rail Cannon. Uh, Ultimega Tolzakin. we got the Weather Painter Rainbow. Super Express Bullet Train. The Danger Bigfoot. And the Prank Kids. Okay, nothing too crazy in that one. What's the last pack? Another Maximum Gold. Okay. All right, I think I have some more maximum gold that we can actually open up, so that'll be cool. The prank, whoa, whoa, that is that is damaged. Okay, the fossil dig, not good. Super, super dreadnought rail cannon juggernaut libe libe libe. I don't know how to say that. Cyframe gear gamma, very nice. Twin twisters, also pretty nice. Summon limit, also pretty nice. And the Cyframe Lord Zeta, very nice. What are we gonna open? Not to worry, this will not be the shortest video of all time. I do have a couple of other things. Maximum Gold El Dorado and a tin that was sent in by a viewer. We can open these up as well. And also, I forgot to open this last pack from Team Sakurazo. I think I dropped it somewhere and found it after the video. So that one's gonna be opened as well. So we've got a few more things to open, so. Hold your horses, not over yet. Let's see if we can continue our luck with the Ten of Ancient Battles, because it's been pretty good so far. Let's see if we can pull something amazing. We've got a Squeak Knight, the Deep Sea Sentry, the Goki Guts, the Red Rain, Gusari Ignister, Captain Roland, the Virtual World Lao Lao, Phantom Knights of Torn Scales, nice, and the Quachadal Chaos. Okay. Okay, not bad, not bad. Now let's try Maximum Gold again. Can we pull something crazy? Can we pull that Red Eyes Black Dragon? Can we pull those epic gold rares? We will pull gold rares. Hopefully some good ones, though. The uh, Primath Bag. It looks like that one kind of got crimped. If you guys can see that, it's a little bit uh, textured there. Number two, the Familiar Possessed Lina and the Romulus. Okay. Not the best pack ever, but it's okay. We got a few more packs to go. On this very strangely paced video, I hope you guys have enjoyed it. If you had, make sure to subscribe. Or, and, um, yeah, I'm sorry about this. I didn't really know this was going to be so short. But here we go. We have the Rastabon. We got the Armory Call. The Shadal Schism. Nice card. The Dogmatica Nexus. The bad Dogmatica card. And the Ariel. Okay. Sh the Nest Shadal Ariel is not bad. Back to the gold. Can we pull more gold? Eva. The Asa. The Numeron Calling. The Access Code Talker! Oh, yeah! Hello! Nice to meet you, Access Code Talker. He's missing part of his name, which seems that Best pack ever? Access Code and Pot of Extravagance? Oh my goodness, double Pot of Extravagance in this video? Okay. That's not bad. I actually need Pot of Extravagance now that I think about this. That's that's pretty good. That's pretty good. We'll take that. On to the next pack. That is incredible. Access Code Talk. I don't know what it goes for these days in gold, but I guess it's still a lot since it's still a pretty amazing card. So we'll take that. Knight's Claw. Soldier Gaia. The Block and Roll. So this turned out to be a pretty good video. And so opening these up. Parallel Exceeds. Not a bad card. Graveyard's Trap Holes. Not a bad card. Opening of the Spirit Cates. Never heard of it. So it's probably a bad card to be honest. Two more. Let's go. Microcoder, Constellar told me, Rescue Cat, Baby Sarasaurus, Code Talker, Sky Striker Ace, Rose, and an Upstart. So, pretty good pack there. Last gold pack, and then we're going to that Astral pack that I forgot to open uh, in the other video. So, let's see what we can pull. Wow, this is a heck of a gold mini box. Oh my gosh. IP Mascarena, Trap Trick, 
And it invoked Mechava. Okay. Wow. What an amazing mini box. Like, insane mini box. And finally, Astro Pack 1. This has been a weird... Oh. I forgot it comes right at the front. So uh, the suspense is over, everyone. Undyne, Ice Edge, and Cyber Shark. Okay, that was a weird ending. A weird ending for a weird video. If you guys enjoyed it, make sure to subscribe to the channel for more epic content. Shout out to TCG, Shuster Cards, Tonefo Show, Tomato Juice, Stanley, Mike Nance, Mimic Gecko, Daxter, Emusa, Junior Barney, and Anatasio, JT Cho, and Animal the Hallowed. Thank you guys for supporting the channel, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.